Oscar Bevis, IFL TV, proudly sponsored by the last Take Two with my man Frank Arnold. Um, yeah, Frank, congratulations. You moved 9 0 tonight. Just sort of your uh, initial reaction stepping out of the ring as a 9 0 professional. Well, not too bad. Got, got, got too complacent, but yeah, got a job done, and that's it. We've literally, well, we've just spoke about this. Um, you said you got too complacent because the first round you were very dominant. I think people could kind of see what way the fight was going to go. And you just said the second round, because you were so good in the first round, the second round, you just sort of switched off a little bit, maybe? Yeah, switched off. I was getting, I had injuries coming to the fight as well, but, you know, no excuses in it, so it is what it is. But, yeah, got to complete on it again. But one thing you will do is learn a lot from tonight because, well, like I said, you got complacent. Um, you're against someone who was given a bit back as well. It's not like you were just standing there and beating someone up who was there to be beaten. Because he was given a, a bit back, you will take a lot away from tonight, wouldn't you? Yeah, I'm going Pull pull hold tough feathers for I think I But I knew I hurt him to the body and then get him out of there. So yeah. How important were the combination punches? Because you were throwing in, like you said, threes and fours, um, uppercuts, hooks, body head. It was a, it was a real mix of a mix of punches. I work on that in the gym, threes and fours consistently for ten rounds. But yeah, it was just a good job at the end of the day. I'm proud. Yeah. We'll see a prospect show, so everyone's learning tonight. What do you think you learned about yourself in the ring? I learned, don't, don't get too complacent, stay with it, and yeah, just just keep throwing combos, basically, but for staying sharp. One thing I do have to say, because I know you might not know this yet, Steve Bunt said that you could become a Ricky Hatton-esque fighter. I'm, gonna, I'm not even going to ask you a question, I'm just going to let you hear that statement, right? Well, yeah, I'm pleased you said that, to be honest, but you know, don't, don't speak too soon, but you know, yeah. Don't get too a bit of pressure on the shoulders, yeah, maybe. Maybe I shouldn't have told you that, should I? You shouldn't have told me that, but you know, a bit of confidence in it, so yeah. Um, I know you're going to want to have an active year. Have you got sort of an idea of when we can next see you up? Uh, I wait for my team to manage, whatever they decide, but I'm going to rest my hands. I had an injury as well, so I'm going to rest that as well, and then yeah, we'll come back as soon as.